And next tonight, our Made in America team is back. After our reporting two years ago, this year, the athletes at the Winter Olympics will be wearing ceremonial uniforms made in America, as promised. But tonight, we have seen something else. Mittens sold by the U.S. Olympic Committee to raise money are made in China. Why? ABC's David Muir back tonight and on the trail of the answers. David. You and I thinking the same thing. Not again. Obviously, there's nothing wrong with selling mittens to raise money for our American athletes. But why not help American workers at the same time? They are the $14 mittens being sold all over the country by the U.S. Olympic Committee. The patriotic message, Go USA, raising money for the athletes at the Winter Games. But you're not only helping athletes with those mittens, you're helping workers in China. Because inside, the second message you'll find, made in China. This all comes less than two years after World News and the Made in America team discovered the Ralph Lauren uniforms for athletes at the opening ceremonies were made in China, too. Our producers head to toe. You'll remember Congress outraged after our reports. I think they should take all the uniforms, put them in a big pile and burn them. Ralph Lauren then promising to make them here and keeping that promise, which is why so many of you were scratching your heads today. Why would the Olympic Committee ignore the labels again? A spokesman for the committee saying we wanted to create a fundraising opportunity where almost anyone could support Team USA. A nod to that $14 price tag on the mittens. But wait a minute. China, the only place that can make a $14 pair of mittens? Made in America segment? Made in America, Made in America series. Our Made in America team on the phones today. So many companies telling us yes, they would have loved the job. It. Hey, World News, we can make these Olympic mittens right here in New Hampshire. The sewing machine's going at Fat Waves in Idaho, already cutting mittens in Duluth, Minnesota. Duluth packed with the label Made in America. And from Baba Zuzu in Michigan, a simple message. We can do this. And with those mittens in hand, we wanted even more proof. We could match the cost. Headed to Lion Brand Yarn, known across the country. A very simple question tonight. Okay. These Olympic mittens, mm -hmm. $14, All right. made in China. Could we make them here for the same amount? I bet we could. And she was out to prove it. They even carry a color already called Olympic Blue. The color is called Olympic? The color is called Olympic, yes. That's right. So this is it right here? This is it right here. And where is it made? It is made in America, right here. And yes. the price? And it is only six forty nine a ball. You could probably get two pairs of mittens out of this. with a Out of one roll. Color. You could help the U.S. Olympic team mm -hmm. and help American workers. Oh, yeah. If you bought American yarn. Yep. And another message from the workers at Midwest Gloves and Gear, arguing tonight... We can do it! Give us a chance. The economist at Boston Consulting Group, in fact, tonight running the numbers for us and saying with the $6 ball of yarn that we found today, obviously a factory could get it even cheaper in bulk. Experts say you absolutely could match that $14 price from China. And Diane, you heard it right. They already have the color Olympic blue Olympic. in stock. And staying on the case again tonight, we'll have more. Thank you, David.